Hey everyone, hope everyone's doing well this great weekend and are all getting ready to gear up for the upcoming week. This is Anish back at you and I'm on week four of my seven app, seven week challenge. And I'm really happy to tell you all that I have a prototype ready for week four. That is for our movie magic uh, reviewer app. And so if you had a chance to look at the previous videos, this particular application, what it does is it integrates APIs like TMDB, uh, Wikipedia, and uh, uses Claude 4 as well to take the name of a movie or a TV show and write a short summary for it, basically for the reader to know what exactly is the movie about without giving away too much of the plot. And so that is the big idea behind Movie Magic Reviewer. And I've also made the front end a little, look a little nice with uh, good posters and uh, gives a rating for that movie. And finally, how is it different from everything out there? This takes that movie name from all across the planet. For example, if you are watching The Diplomat as an Iranian TV show, I didn't know that existed, right? And so we all think of the American TV show, The Diplomat. And so it gives all the results and summaries for all of them as well. So it's not just for English uh, based or uh, US based movies. And so with that, let me show you a short demo for it. And so here you can see that this was, I had the diplomat as the uh, default, but let's say I want to look at uh, Titanic. Okay. And so let me go in here and fetch the details. And so you can see that this particular application, the whole idea was the architecture behind this. This is a Kubernetes application where the pods are running inside EKS clusters. And uh, what is going to happen is EKS is going to orchestrate the entire containers. And uh, what I'm doing is I'm going to have a controller that's going to have a load balancer. It's sitting in front of the containers and that is going to be fronted by API Gateway and API Gateway is going to expose the uh, endpoint to the client which is written in Swift, okay? So here you can see that the first one is the Titanic movie most of us have seen. The second one we probably don't know but it's a 1953 film and so you can take a look at it and get a little bit of an idea. The third one is uh, something else. The fourth one is a documentary and so we have different titanics and so that's the point of this application is it gives a sort of a comprehensive idea into the name of movie even if it's a, an international movie and so hopefully you like this application again there are a lot of applications like this but this particular uh, week was all about the different architecture that we are using for deploying this application and specifically we create uh, containers and uh, deploy them with the help of EKS specifically we use Kubectl and EKS CTL commands to uh, connect to AWS and in yesterday and day before's video I show a little bit more detail into how the deployment.yaml, the service.yaml and the secrets.yaml look like what's the minimum structure you need for a Kubernetes application. And yesterday I did a couple of bite-sized videos where you can get an idea about EKS, how to deploy on EKS and everything else. And so do check it out. And then tomorrow I'll probably show a Swift uh, app demo for this and uh, look at the Swift code. And finally, I plan to submit it to the App Store tomorrow for review and hopefully by Wednesday week four app, uh, the iOS app should be in the app store as well. So with that, uh, that's week four, everyone. Hope you all have a good rest of your week and I'll catch you all tomorrow. Peace out.